<laughs> Welcome to DC and Marvel Facts and Trivia with Buds. I'm your host, Ryan Buds. You might recognize me from a few other shows right here on the stream.tv. I host uh, the Gotham After Show on Mondays, and I used to host the Flash After Show on Tuesdays. I have an amazing show for you tonight with some amazing guests that are going to compete in trivia of the Marvel and DC variety. Tonight's theme is sidekicks right robin everybody loves robin right you need a robin if you got a batman and we're going to talk all about robin and a million other sidekicks right here on the stream tonight if you are watching this live right now i would love for you to interact with us leave us comments with your answers to these trivia questions and uh, you can kind of play along if you have a question of your own comment in on the live stream with that and we will try and get to all those questions throughout the night um, we have an amazing panel of uh, two teams we have a team marvel and a team dc but before we get to them we are competing for a Old Man Logan poster. This is by a great artist in Sweden named The Sunny Five. And if you get the most right answers in the comments correct, you will win this poster along with uh, one of our teams here tonight. And um, we are going to introduce those teams right now. Uh, we're going to start with Team Marvel and Mr. Yeah. Dallas James. How are you, Dallas? I'm great, thank you. Dallas, you uh, run a show over in Burbank, California, every Friday night called The Stranger Than Fiction Show. Tell I us do. about that. I do. Uh, the Stranger Than Fiction Show, it's a, it's a 90 minute improv comedy show, 60 minute short form, very much like the show Whose Line Is It Anyway? And then uh, 20 to 30 minutes of uh, improvised music at the end with our uh, alternative. Uh, uh, throwback 80s rock band uh, Phoenix, which is uh, the highlight of my day. <laughs> Fantastic. And uh, you teach children's improv uh, with uh, a group called the LA Connection for Kids by Kids. I do, I do. I teach uh, uh, short form on Sundays to, uh, to the children uh, of the area. And we also perform weekly shows with the kids. With the oh, kids. that's very cool. I really uh, think that's admirable. And you've also written a few books for kids, Walter the Earthworm and the Iron Relic. Right. Walter What's the this earthworm? earthworm up to? Tell me about it. Uh, well, it's a story of a little guy earthworm who gets permission to go outside on his own for the first time. Very good. I have so, a book club, and uh, I think that's going to be our next pick, actually. That sounds pretty good. <laughs> oh, awesome, awesome. Because he does run into a couple of obstacles that a normal kid, like the first time you can cross the street, first time. Uh, allowed to do things that a normal person, you know, kind of runs across. I love it. Next up on Team Marvel, we have Miss Le Liz Fenning. How are you, Liz? I'm good. Thank you. I'm happy Liz, to be here. I am very excited that you're here because uh, you are excited to play some trivia today. You're so excited. You had a big book of notes that you were studying over about sidekick <laughs> trivia questions. Yes. Well, um, so I watched uh, your amazing uh, pilot episode of this last week. Oh, thanks. And um, it had a lot of the stream TV uh, hosts on it, and yeah. they're like trivia Jedi. Um, so I just, I, I didn't want to come here and, and fail. Yeah, um, you wanted and, to be ready. Yes, and I, I, I grew up more as a Trekkie, so like mm -hmm. I, I've, I've loved DC and Marvel forever, but um, maybe not Jedi level skills. Like, Did you bring a number two before. pencil? Um, no. You might be out of luck, mm -hmm. Liz. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, you've starred in several movies like uh, Ghost Hunters, Lions Gates, Ghost Machine, and The Living, and uh, oh my God, we're in a horror movie. Mm -hmm. Tell me about that last one. I like that title. Um, it, it's a it's a, an amazing one. Um, uh, filmmaker Jayla Bandale. It was like his first um, feature that he had out. Um, it's about. Uh, people who are playing um, settlers of Catan, okay. and they end up, um, uh, someone rolls a dice, um, someone kicked a cat earlier, and all of a sudden we're in a horror movie, and I am um, a crazy Trekkie ex-girlfriend. Oh in my it. god. Um, Is that based on any truth? Do you have any Trekkie experience? I, I do have a lot of Trekkie experience. <laughs> um, I was, I was that like, explains I think the, the red one, sweater, guys. Yeah. Actually, yeah, inside number one. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, I, I was like the only Trekkie in Moscow, Idaho. Uh, Moscow, little... Idaho, that's where it says you're from on yes. your little bio you sent yes. me. And I thought it was Moscow at first, and then I realized it was Idaho. So I was really excited, and then I was like, oh, Idaho, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, that's that's the normal response to <laughs> Moscow, Idaho. It's like, oh, oh, that's okay. The next Die Hard takes place in Moscow, Idaho. A lot of people don't know that. That would it's be called, uh, Die Hard 65. Yeah, the yeah, Mormon. The forestry the Mormon, Mormon experience. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and lastly, you work uh, with a program. You're a program supervisor called uh, for a program called Actors for Autism. Tell yeah. us, a, Give us a quick rundown on that. Okay, um, so we do vocational work for young adults um, with disabilities in film, animation, video game design, and visual effects. Amazing. Um, and then we also reinforce social skills with acting as an art therapy tool. So um, my day job rocks. Very cool. Awesome, Liz. We're moving over here on to yeah. Team D.C. Likewise, with my good friend Alvin Rueda. What's up, Alvin? What up, Buds? How you doing, brother? <laughs> Alvin, we just met, but 
but we just bonded uh, before we started this yeah. live stream about wrestling. Yeah. Uh, you're a big wrestling, <laughs> wrestling buddy of mine nerds. now. <laughs> yeah, that's right. And uh, you are an Emmy award-winning producer and editor. I am. I what, am. Did you, what did you win uh, an Emmy for? I won an Emmy back in New York when I used to work for News 12 Networks, mm -hmm. uh, doing a feature like a mini doc yeah. on post-traumatic stress, stress disorder. Very good. And we, they were skydiving yeah. for a good cause. So okay. that was that was pretty awesome. You guys are doing a lot of good yeah. causes over here. Yeah, so I think tonight is going to be a very, very fun night. You've covered Comic-Cons. You've interviewed the cast of The Walking Dead, Avengers, etc. Yeah, Who yeah, was your I've favorite Avenger to interview, Alvin? Who was it? Was it Hawkeye? Uh, was it the Hulk? <laughs> no, you know what? The Hulk, he was cool because I compared him with other Hulks. And he was super cool about it, so, yeah. you know, I really liked him. Chris Evans was chill, too. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, uh, they were all good. They were all fun. <laughs> Fantastic. Of course, they had to be, right? <laughs> they have to. They're the Avengers. Yeah. Uh, this is your next, uh, uh, this is your teammate right here on uh, to your left side, my right side, Mr. Jacob Smith. Yeah. The rest of Team DC. How do you feel about representing Team DC today? I feel pretty great about it. You got your blue yeah, shirt on. I wore a blue shirt, <laughs> yeah. especially for this. To combat the Marvel to team over here, our yeah, red sweater. I wore Liz. the blue shirt all day, <laughs> yeah. just to live in it. Jacob, you're really from the good. Midwest, Chicago and Des Moines, yep. which is not too far where I am from. Are you a Cubs fan or a Sox fan? I'm Cubs fan. Oh, uh, what a year born. to be a Cubs fan, yeah. right? Yeah, it, it feels great. Did to... you go out and bang a pot when, you, uh, <laughs> when they won? I think I about destroyed everything in my apartment. Yeah. Um, well, during the, there was the rain delay. Sure. Um, when everyone thought the curse was going to happen again. Oh, yeah. Um, and that's when I started destroying things, just ritualistically, and then sure. I calmed down and then destroyed everything else with excitement. Yep. So, and yeah. And you have uh, currently have four jobs, it tells me, in this next bullet point. Uh, four jobs. Yeah. Uh, besides H&M model, what are your other three jobs? <laughs> um, gap model. Gap model. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, I, um, I teach. I tutor mm -hmm. separately. I tutor a student. Sure. I work in reality TV, yeah. and number four is um, Saturday's social skills teaching. Yeah. So I guess three yeah. different sort of teaching jobs than one in reality TV. Sure. Looking at millions of hours of footage. You work on that Kardashian show, is that the one? <laughs> no, it's, Are you a, a um, Kardashian? Did I not get that right? Jacob, Car no, nope, it's uh, Smith. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> I'm going to marry into the Kardashians one day. That is a smart move. Nice. I might do that too. Sorry, yeah. honey. That makes home. you go nuts, though, right? <laughs> yeah. Does that make you like, self destruct? Of course, of course. Yeah. Uh, this is how it works, everybody watching at home. We're going to have uh, <laughs> Team DC versus Team Marvel tonight. And uh, we're going to go through 20 questions about Marvel and DC sidekicks. So we're going to have them buzz in with a buzz in word. And that buzz in word today is, like we mentioned in the show's intro, Robin. So when you know the answer to one of these questions, <coughs> just yell Robin. I will try and keep track of who said it first. And then that person will have a chance to answer the question. The first round is uh, 20 questions, all uh, questions that I wrote about DC and Marvel sidekicks. Then we'll move on to round number two, which is 10 questions from the fans. I had people commented on Instagram, send me text messages, and hit me up on Facebook with amazing sidekick questions. So we're going to go on to those for two points. And then we'll end things with a round called Categories with Buds, where I'll play with you guys. And we all name one item from a certain category, like spaces on a Monopoly board, or villains from Star Trek, or something like that. Uh, so it'll be really fun. It'll have something to do with sidekicks. And uh, we're going to get started right now. You guys ready to play? Yep. Ready. Let's do this. this is round number one. We call it the trivia showdown. Okay? So wait for the whole question to be read so people can play along at home. And uh, this is round number one. Question number one. The buzz and word is Robin. Here we go. <laughs> number one. What is the name of Batman's canine crime-fighting partner? What is the name of Batman's canine crime-fighting partner? Batman. <laughs> We're talking Batman. First question, they are consulting against each other. Buzz in with the word Robin. Team DC, Team Marvel, talking it out, hashing it out. We'll give it about five seconds before we move on to the next question. What is the name of Batman's canine crime-fighting partner? This one goes to back in the day. Wow. Ah. I'm a Batman fanatic, too, and I don't you remember. You don't know wow. it? Any no. guesses from anybody? Uh, I'm going to give the answer. Uh, let's see if anybody knows it. it real quick. Yeah. 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 If anyone knows uh, it. Nope, nobody in the chat yep. has commented in. It's Ace the Bat Hound. What? Ace, Ace the Bat Hound oh, is okay. the name of Batman's <laughs> canine crime fighting partner. So that's the first question. Stumped you guys. Stumped you. Good start. Good start. Good, start. Good, 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 good question. Yeah. Good question. Sidekicks, so question number two. Yeah. Buzzing with the word Robin. Foggy Nelson shares a law firm with what superhero? 
Robin. Hi, Robin. Yeah. Dallas. Uh, Daredevil. It was Daredevil. Nice well guys. done. Dallas got one point for mm -hmm. Team Marvel. It sounds like you knew it too, Alvin. You I watch a lot of Daredevil? It. I do. Man, that Netflix yeah. show is coming back soon. I, I can't watch wait. it for the violence. That's what I do. <laughs> I watch it for the tight hallway fight scenes where people oh, are just getting oh, flipped it. and thrown yeah. through tight quarters. That's my favorite part of that show. <laughs> uh, question number three, buzz in with Robin. This is back to the DC side. The original Kid Flash had what civilian name? Robin. Wally West. It is Wally uh, West. I, you know what? I was about to buzz yeah. instead and of saying we, Robin. Yes. Yeah. And, and we, we didn't have buzz. <laughs> we were trying. I went, uh, uh, we, I like, for the Robin. listeners and uh, viewers at home, we had uh, some buzzers that we we're going to try, but they had like a big delay. <laughs> yeah. So we're going to see what we got next week, and this show is evolving. I had a podium last week. Now I'm in like a judge's chair. So we're going to keep working it out yeah. and see what works. But next <laughs> week we may have buzzers. All right. And you'll be flying. <laughs> yes. Very good. Question number four. Here it is. Uh, this is about uh, Marvel. Uh, sidekicks. Rocket Raccoon and Groot are sidekicks to each other, but who does their voices? Robin. Ro oh. Jacob. Bradley Cooper. Yes. And. Um, oh, he's got half oh, of it. I, 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 know, I know this. Alvin, um, you can do a whisper. You guys are on the same team. Yeah, we can whisper. We got Bradley Cooper. Uh, uh, Vin, Vin Diesel. Diesel. And Vin Diesel, yeah. that was okay. the other one. Yeah. Well done. That's team yes. effort right there. That's yes. team effort. And Team DC has one point. I was blanking out on his Marvel. name. I was like, who the hell? What, what <laughs> was his <two>. name? Vin <laughs> Diesel. Did you guys know it on this side? There is like we a did. little delay when we you did. hear the question. You're like, I, that, yeah. Ah, yeah. You know? I was going to say Bradley Cooper and Bradley Cooper. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just one. Some people playing along at home. Uh, Gendrick Hartz says Vin Diesel, so they knew that one. Shout yeah, out well. to Gendrick. Well done. Alyssa says they should get this. Uh, they should get the staples. That was easy button, and that is what we had, Alyssa. Oh, yeah. That is literally. Hold up, one. Do we grab yeah. one down there? Yeah. Yeah. We have four of these, but there's such a delay. So this is what they. In they different languages. Oh, yeah. There it is. There yeah. it is. Yeah. That was easy. It's a very big delay, so we thought it would kind of slow down the show. Yeah. But we did have those. We're going to keep that there just for fun. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> this is question number five, and it is about DC sidekicks. What villain is Poison Ivy's brute and sidekick in Joel Schumacher's film Batman and Robin? Robin. Bane. It is Bane. Well uh, done. Uh, Alvin uh, has one point, making it uh, one point for everybody or two yeah. points for each team. Yeah. Well done, All Alvin. Right. Uh, you, Batman and Robin, one of the campiest of these superhero films we've ever seen in theaters, right? <laughs> Fun to watch. A lot of right puns, a lot of ice puns. If you haven't seen it, go watch it right now. That was the best flick Arnold Schwarzenegger was ever in. Yes. Down. And I think Robin oh. says the line, holy rusted metal Batman in that movie, Ooh, which is one of my yeah, favorite did, lines. Man. Or maybe Batman Forever, I'm not sure. Here's question number six. It's back to the Marvel side for sidekick trivia. James Rhodes is known as... Uh, uh, what Iron Man sidekick? Uh, Robin. Robin. Jacob. War Machine. Uh, it is War Machine. Two uh, points for uh, nice. Jacob, making a total of three for Team DC. Uh, War Machine, played by Don Cheadle in yeah. the uh, movies. Originally, Terrence Howard. And then there was right. some kind of dispute. Yeah. And, over money. Uh, over money. Contract yeah. Seems yeah. like it's yeah. always about money in this Hollywood industry, isn't it? Yeah. Very good. I think Don Cheadle's gotten plenty of money for that now. I think he's okay. Yeah. I think he's doing just fine. Uh, number seven. This is back to DC. Everyone knows the Joker's main squeeze is Harley Quinn, but what was her name before she turns all crazy? Robin. Liz. Harleen Francis. Quinzo? You got it. Well oh, done. Good job. You got all three <laughs> names. Yeah. Nice job, Liz. Liz, I feel like <laughs> uh, I think this is a compliment. Hopefully, you take it as one. I feel like you would be you would pull off an excellent Harley Quinn cosplay. Have you ever done it? Um, no, but that's the biggest compliment ever. Right? So Look at the camera and give us like a Harley Quinn yeah. something. Can you do anything? Oh wow. Does she have any cool lines? <laughs> what does what does she say uh, to, to Joker all the time? Uh, Puddin. She calls Puddin. him Puddin. Yeah. I mean, I, I don't think I could. Do you don't it. want to pull it off? Give a hey. Pudding. All right, I'm going to do it. Hey, Puddin. Yeah. That's it. We got it. We got <laughs> it. We got Mr. the J. J. Nice to Mr. J. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Question number yeah, eight. Yeah, just end up sounding like a Jersey girl. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Question number eight. Who is also known as the Winter Soldier? Robin. Oh, uh, Jacob. Robin. Robin. Uh, what did I? Uh, uh, Captain America. Uh, no, Robin. No, Robin. Correct. <laughs> Dallas. Bucky. Bucky Barnes. That's right. And that's oh, another point for I old Dallas. <laughs> it is four points for Team Marvel to three points for Team DC. We don't so lose it's very if close. We're wrong. Nope. You never lose points. Good. But I do slap you with a ruler. So get your hands out. We're going to get that ruler. Earned, I earned it. In just for that a second. One. And then I'll hit the that was easy button. It this makes is me number. so uncomfortable screaming huh? out Robin. <laughs> <laughs> number nine. Here we go. Who is Clark Kent's biggest sidekick at the Daily Planet? Robin. Robin. 
Dallas. Jimmy Olsen. Jimmy Olsen is correct. That's three points mm -hmm. for uh, Dallas, Dallas for a total of five. It. He's kicking some butt Ooh. over there. Uh, Dallas, I feel like you might be able to pull off a Jimmy Olsen cosplay. How do you feel about that? Mm. <laughs> uh, I think I will try next time. Very yeah. good. Uh, yeah. I will consider that a challenge. And challenge I <laughs> love it. Question number 10. This is uh, halfway through the first round about sidekicks. These are all questions I came up with. If you have some fun questions, chat in and uh, we will get to those uh, very soon. Number 10. What is the name of the hacker that helps the Punisher find rare ammo and exotic weapons? It's a tough question. I didn't know this one. That one uh, is without looking it up. Uh, Any guesses? What's the name of the hacker that helps the Punisher find rare ammo and exotic weapons? Oh, jeez. It's like one word. It's like a compounded word, kind oh, of. Oh, no. My Any brain guesses? just went to cowboy. Robin. Robin. Yes. Hacksaw. That's a great guess. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Hacksaw Jim Duggan won the first Royal Rumble for the wrestling tribute. <laughs> for everybody out there. But it was not Hacksaw, but that's a great guess. Any other guesses? The answer was, uh, oh, you got one? No. Microchip. Microchip oh. was what I was looking wow, for. that's a good one. Name okay. was Microchip. <laughs> Alyssa's playing along. Yes. She uh, had War Machine for our Don Sheetle question. Nice. Uh, and then she said, uh, ooh, damn, I didn't even know she had a middle name about uh, Harleen right. Francis Quinzel. Oh, so well done, that. Liz. <laughs> Educating the masses out there, one chat person at a time. Here is number 11. This is another dog question. You guys ready for another dog question? Yes. Okay. Great. What is the name yeah. of the white dog that has the same powers as Cal L? Robin. Robin. I heard Dallas first, I think. Crypto. Uh, it is Crypto. Four points yeah, there. Yeah, Alvin was a very close dog. second. But that is what we're looking for, Crypto. Okay. Question number 12. In the Deadpool movie, Colossus is joined by what female counterpart? Colossus in the Deadpool movie has what female teammate? Robin. Movie? Um, yes. Her name was... Three Something words. ridiculous. Yeah, three words. Uh, kind of crazy. Um, what and why am I forgetting? I'm having a brain fart right now. Let's I see. Um, I can picture her, but I can't. Oh, I, yeah, it's, it's a goth girl. Uh, yeah. yeah. Any guesses? She's awesome too. Oh, what the hell is her name again? Um, I'll give you the last word. Warhead. Does that help <laughs> no? Jesus. I totally <laughs> forgot. It's a tough one. Negasonic, Negasonic Teenage, teenage Warhead. Warhead. Negasonic. Oh, that's it. I never even heard that word before I looked up her name. Nega. N-E-G-A Sonic. Nega Sonic Teenage Warhead. She teams up with Colossus in that movie. And Lewis Love, who was on last week's pilot episode of this very trivia show, said he knows the actor that plays Colossus. And uh, that is very cool because I want a copy of that movie very much on my iPad. And maybe he can hook it up. You think yeah, he can do it? Yeah. Colossus could probably pull it off. Oh, yeah. 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 He should be able He's to. He's made of metal. Yeah. Here's number 13, everybody. Which Robin name was the first full-time female Robin in the history of Batman? Robin. Liz. Stephanie Brown? Incorrect, but that is a Robin. Wait. The first one is a different name, if I am uh, to be correct. Maybe I'm wrong. People can let me know in the chat if I'm wrong. Any other guesses? Carrie Kelly? That's what I'm looking for. Okay, Carrie, Carrie Kelly. Kelly. The 13-year-old. I'm going to give I'm going to give it to Liz. Liz got wow. it there. Yeah. Carrie Kelly Good was job, Liz. based Good on uh, what I looked up. So well done. A lot of different Robins out there, so they do get confusing. Here's number 14. Yeah. Katie Cassidy played what arrow sidekick? Robin. Alvin. Um it's um well I'm having a lot of brain farts today. <laughs> so so excuse me. He's got a Superman shirt on there. I, 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 I don't know. I don't know I'm off my game today. I'm off my game today. Yeah. And I was just watching Arrow too. Of course. Which is uh, pretty ridiculous. Mm -hmm. Um Mega ridiculous? Uh, no, no, no. Katie no. Cassidy <laughs> played what arrow sidekick? I I, I can't I believe I'm having a brain fart right now. It's um um <laughs> Team Marvel, any guesses? Oh, I, I, I know it, I know it, I know it. Go, 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 go. You can do it, go. Why am I having a brain Three drawing? seconds. It's, um, uh... Team Marvel, chance to guess? Katie Cassidy played what arrow sidekick? She's not M one of the Laurel red Lance is her name. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna call it, it's Black Canary. Black Canary. That's what I'm looking oh, for. Black Canary. I don't know what oh, something's wrong with me today. <laughs> I'm getting really off. Alvin, I really know this too. Alvin knows a lot about Arrow and also Legends of Tomorrow, which yeah. is uh, yeah. one of the after shows here on the stream.tv that you can see Alvin on. And uh, it's a very fun show. Also, Patrick Campbell, who was on last week's pilot episode of this trivia show, is one of the after show hosts. Yeah. If you ever want to check that out, what night does that air on? Wednesdays? Wednesdays. Wednesday nights. Legends nights. is Tuesdays. Legends is Tuesdays. <laughs> that I remember. Oh. Just got to get on my game. Uh, check out those after shows right <laughs> here on too much before this. TV. <laughs> here comes question number 15. What is Matt Murdock's love interest foe and sometimes sidekick's name? What is Matt Murdock's love interest foe and sometimes sidekick's name? Matt Murdock. Any guesses here? I know this Buzzing too. Buzzing with Robin. I know this too. Guys <laughs> are consulting I, I each other. I like the teamwork tonight. Um, 
I feel like you guys should have been on the same team with the matching shirts and underwear. Yeah, that's right? pretty good. I know. <laughs> I'm matching his yeah. Superman. While you guys are consulting, I'm going to check the chat. Let's see. Alyssa says, Crypto, I love this show. I'm going to comment back to her. Well done, Alyssa. You rock. I'm going to call it as well, everybody, for that question. Electra. That's what I'm looking for. Electra. Oh. Big character on season two of Daredevil. Electra yeah. is a love interest foe and sometimes sidekick because they fight side by side, especially on season two of that show. Of uh, number 16, what is Batman's paralyzed sidekick's name? Robin. Robin. Liz. Uh, Barbara Gordon, who eventually becomes Oracle. That's right, Oracle. It is <laughs> nine points for Team Marvel to three We're points right. on Team DC. <laughs> They need to kick it up a notch, and maybe they will with the rest you of know, these I, questions. I, I, just, I just want to lose them purpose. I want to make you guys feel good about yourselves. <laughs> Very really good. Oh, that's that. a good strategy. Thank you. Thank I'm you. with that strategy. Yeah. Number 17, back to the Marvel side. What X-Men character plays a young sidekick to Wolverine in the first film? Robin? Liz. What? Jubilee? No. Incorrect, but great guess. Rogue? What X-Men? Yes, Alvin gets it with Rogue. Yeah. Uh, she's uh, tagging along with Wolverine, especially at the beginning of the first X-Men film. Mm. Question number 18. Roy Harper is a replica of what DC hero? Robin. Robin. Liz. The original Speedy. Incorrect. No. Alvin. Arsonist. Incorrect. <gasps> oh. Any other guesses? Uh, Can you repeat Robin? the question, please? Roy Harper. Harper is a replica of what DC hero? Arrow. It is the Green oh. Arrow. I'm gonna give it to Alvin. Oh. Well done. Well I done. You, I thought you meant like what? Is, what was his name? I got gotcha. you. I got gotcha. you. I thought he became I mean, the Green, green Arrow. Oh, yeah. 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 Question <laughs> number 19. Rick Jones was a straight man sidekick to what Marvel beast? Robin. Uh, Liz. Hulk. The Hulk. Yes. That's right. Five points gives you guys a total of uh, nice. uh, three, four. You have nine. You have nine to uh, five over here. So Team Marvel winning by just a little bit. And we have one more question left for these first 20 in round one. And it is about a Batman villain. Arnold Wesker right. is a Batman villain with a sidekick he voices named what? Arnold Wesker is a Batman villain with a sidekick he voices named what? He was on a, definitely a handful of episodes from Batman the Animated Series. I have the figure on a shelf at home because I am a 31-year-old <laughs> Nerd. <laughs> you guys know this one? Arnold what? Arnold Wesker is a Wesker. Batman villain with a sidekick he voices named what? If you're playing along at home, chat it Batman. up. Leave me a nice chat comment what? if you know the answer to this one. Is that what it is? I think that, um, Any guesses? It's a question one more time. Arnold Wesker is a Batman villain with a sidekick <laughs> um, he voices named what? Yeah, I don't know if I should be up this high. I feel like Judge Judy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to call it the answer was Scarface, everybody. Scarface, oh, the little ventriloquist oh, dummy. Oh, that's, that's right. With the ventriloquist, uh, who is Arnold Wesker. Wow. That's the end of round number one. It is nine for Team Marvel to five for Team DC. How do you guys feel after like the first round? How do you feel? Yeah. Jake, what do you got to do to come back in round number two? I think I will start answering questions correctly. There you go. That's a good strategy. <laughs> I like so that. Wrong. Dallas yeah. is going to continue to rock this pendant <laughs> yes. he stole from the set of Point Break, and I that's going to be yeah, a lot of fun for everybody. Yeah. This is uh, round number two. Now, these are uh, fan questions. These are worth two points if you get these right. A little bit harder, okay. and, uh, and some easy ones mixed in, but these are from uh, friends on Facebook, fans of the show, people who commented in with really fun sidekick Marvel and DC questions. And we're going to start off with one from Bobby Hill. Okay? So this is question number one. It's worth two points. And this is round number two, fan questions. Number one, what were the names of Two Faces female sidekicks in Batman Forever? Buzzing with Robin. Robin. Alvin. Um. Two Faces, female sidekicks in Batman Forever. What were the names? Well, one of them was Drew Barrymore. That is right. Played by actress <laughs> Drew Barrymore. Do you yeah, remember their names right. from the movie? Uh, it was something awesome, too. <laughs> Damn it. it Any was, guesses um, from anybody? It was... Gosh, I do you remember what it was. Team Marvel, Chicken thinking it over? What? I'm going to give it to you guys right now. It's Sugar and Spice. Ah. Sugar and Spice were the name of those two ladies. I was so and close to guessing something totally different. Very good. Like yeah. Salt and Pepper, Maybe yeah. like uh, the Push I was going girls. to go with like Helter and Skelter. Helter and Skelter. That would be yeah. good, too. I like I Salt and Pepper. You know. with Spinderella. I was going to say Kitten. Spinderella. Yeah. Get her up in the mix. <laughs> uh, Bobby Hill stumped you guys with that question from totally. Facebook. Thanks for the question, Bobby. Yeah. Thanks, yeah. Bobby. He's also from Chicago, I think. Uh, number two, yeah. Dick Grayson became Nightwing and eventually moved to which city? Robin. Bloodhaven. Yes. Bloodhaven is correct. And that came from Kyle Dodson, who's a huge fanboy. And he's a producer over on America's Funniest Videos. Thank you very much, Kyle, yeah, Kyle. Dodson. Nice Bloodhaven, yeah, that's Kyle. two points for Al, uh, Alvin and Team DC. So that gives them a nice 
uh, seven points to the nine that we have over here. So okay. you guys can come back yeah. very easily. Yeah. Nice. This is question number three. It comes from Justin Bernal, who is a uh, trivia with Bloods player. Thank you so much, Justin, for this question. And uh, this is about Robin. Which Robin is killed by Joker in a death in the family? Robin. Robin. Liz. Jason Todd. That's right, Jason Todd. Two points yeah. for Liz. Well done. Uh, question number four comes to us from Nick yeah. Baum from the Chicagoland area. Nick Baum had a question which had nothing to do with DC or Marvel, but I wanted to throw it in because I watched this movie nonstop as a kid. Same. My mom would rent it for me on VHS, and here's the question. Who started the movie Sidekicks with Chuck Norris? Robin. 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 I'm going to say Jacob. Um, Jonathan... Brandis? Yes, you got it, sir. That's nice. two points nice. for you. Jacob <laughs> ties up the game. It's nine to nine, Whoa. just like that. Actually, no. Uh, it is 11 to nine, but you got very close to tying up. You guys, Team Marvel have 11, Team DC has nine, and it was Jonathan Brandis, Chuck Norris. I love that movie. He just imagines his idol as helping him through all these tough <laughs> boyhood times. And then they just completely rip off the karate kid the rest of the time. It does, like, doesn't he actually like meet the point. celebrity of Chuck Norris yeah. in the yeah. movie at in the, the end? In the final yeah. tournament. And they climb a rope or something? Yeah. And, yes. Winnie, and Winnie Cooper's in. Winnie Cooper. Winnie Cooper. Very good. Question number this five comes from, again, from Kyle Dodson over at AFV. He says, what is the name of the blue monkey sidekick to the Wonder Twins? That's a tough one. The blue monkey oh, sidekick oh, to the Wonder damn. Twins. Um, Any oh, guesses? He said, um, yeah. I don't remember it. I see the little This is a tough yeah. one. Yeah. yeah it's one word. Question, it is a word, I think, which means to, like, spit in a certain way. Gleek. It is Gleek. I'm going to give you one oh, right. for helping oh, you yes. Yeah. Jacob. Yes. That was a Midwest. That was a Midwest thing. Yeah. Kids used to yeah. spit on each other. Like, it was like you make right. like a very yeah. small stream of spit come out. Yeah, you just make this dumb face and then like a little bit of spit. Like a real weirdo. Yeah. Yeah. Jacob's yeah. going to be gleeking yeah. all over I, the I place. Tried, that I was had, my childhood. I had tried gleek the gleek. stuck, and that was the little spongy yes. thing from Herculoids. So there you go. Time. It was one letter difference. I'm getting saved by the non... Um, <laughs> Very good. Yeah. Number six, Arlene yeah. Sorkin voiced what Batman the Animated Series sidekick villain? Arlene Sorkin. And then later voiced by somebody else, I believe. But Arlene Sorkin voiced what Batman the Animated Series sidekick villain? I'm going to guess Robin. Yes. Harley Quinn? It is Harley Quinn. Oh, that question, yes. that question yes. comes from yeah. Fabian uh, Castro. Thank you, Fabian. That Thank was a you, nice question. Yeah. Number seven, who was the Green Hornets sidekick? Robin. Yes. Kato. It was Kato. Oh, Two yeah. more for Alvin. He's kicking butt this round. Told you, Rocky. And, uh, Rocky of trivia. The, <laughs> the Green Hornet, not always a DC property, but now the DC uh, makes the comics, the newer yeah, comics for right. Green Hornet. Number eight, what is the name of the Blue Devil's sidekick? Robin. Liz. Uh, the uh, Kid Devil. Kid Devil or Red Devil will be acceptable. Well nice. done, uh, Liz. Two <laughs> points for you. And that comes from Jamie Philbrick, who was one of the contestants on last week's DC and Marvel Facts and Tribute. Yeah. But Damn Damn thank you, Jamie, Jamie. Thanks, for Jamie. participating. <laughs> In the show. Remember that, Jamie. <laughs> Number nine, what was the name of Harley Quinn's gang of five similarly dressed gals? What do you think? Five similarly dressed gals. Oh, uh, Robin, this yes. is just based on, like, it would be very funny. Something uh, playing on the word quintet. That's right, the quintets was correct. Wow. Two points for Liz. Wow. They were called right, the quintets. Man. All I looked up yep. real quick, quickly was, like, a gang of gals dressed like that, and it was really cool. The yeah. quintets, I'm going to look into that. <laughs> and uh, try and read whatever the story that was. <laughs> this is the last question from the fans. Number 10, Aqualad, who is Aquaman's sidekick, eventually went and changed his name to what? Robin, Robin. Tempest. It is Tempest oh. Liz. <laughs> nice. Kicking Damn butt it. with the Jeez. buzz in. It really helps the study, doesn't it, Liz? Well done. Uh, like that was from Kaylin Marie, or just Kaylin on Instagram. Well done, Kaylin, great question. <laughs> great questions from everybody. Yeah. Thank you so much. Let me yeah. check the chat Wait, real fans. quick. Yeah. Alyssa's talking a lot in there. Uh, someone named Poop Bucket Cartoons. Uh, my good friend Jason Bice. <laughs> Uh, Jendrick Hearts is in there, and uh, also Pretty Kitty Miller says hi. Ooh. So hi, Pretty Kitty Miller. This is our last round, everybody. This is the wrap-up <coughs> round. It's worth three points if you're the last man or woman standing in this, and it is called Categories with Buds. So now we're going to jump out of the DC and Marvel realms, and this is uh, a round where we go around the circle and we each name a uh, uh, something from a category, something like Spaces on a Monopoly Board or um, actors that have played superheroes or something like that. Today's category, because it's sidekicks, is side dishes, okay? So we're going to go around the circle. I'll kick it off. You just have to name a side dish. It has to be kind of like a traditional side dish. You can't be like, my mom always had ham as a side dish. That's not really like a side dish, okay? So as long as we kind of all agree, it'll be acceptable. If you can't think of one, you're eliminated, and the last person standing will get three points for their team, and that could mean a big difference. Let me count these up real quick. We have uh, 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 right now for Team Marvel, and we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 for Team 
uh, DC. So no matter what, it actually looks like we have our winners over here with Team Marvel already. But if you guys win, you will have only oh. lost by one point. Wow. So that is, you need this. You need this. pride. Okay. You need the pride. pride. Okay. Okay. I'm going to kick it off, and then nice. we'll go around this way to Dallas and back around to Alvin and Jacob. Okay. Here we go. First side dish <coughs> is sweet potato fries. Mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. Green beans. Green beans. Onion rings. Onion rings. Corn casserole. Corn casserole. Potato salad. Coleslaw. Coleslaw. Mandarin oranges. Yes, mandarin oranges. Cream spinach. Cream spinach. Cooked baby carrots. Cooked baby carrots. I'm going to say, uh, 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 oh my god, I can't think of anything. Did you guys say green bean casserole? Someone say that. Somebody said green yeah. beans. Yeah. yeah. I gotta think of oh, a better I one. <laughs> I gotta think of a better one on my own show. Oh my god, oh my god. French fries. French fries. Uh. Cool. Red yes. beans and rice. Red beans and rice. Brussels sprouts. Brussels sprouts. Sweet potato fries. I said that oh. first, so unfortunately, oh. Alvin, you are eliminated. Oh. Damn it. We're down to three. Jacob. <laughs> Mac and cheese. Oh. Mac and cheese. I'm going to say uh, 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 I'm eliminated because I can't think of one. Oh. Dallas. Oh, baked beans. Baked beans. Liz. Refried beans. Refried beans. Jacob. Hash browns. Hash browns. Dallas. Um. Go Eliminated, Done. it's down oh. to Liz. It's down to Jacob. Let's see what Liz can do. Macaroni salad. Macaroni salad. <laughs> Cream spinach. Cream spinach. I'm getting hungry. Some bosas. What is that? Um, they're like an Indian kind of, they're like pakora. Sounds made up. Liz, I'm going to accept it. Jacob. <laughs> oh, no. uh, I'll go garlic fries. Garlic fries. He's going very specific with the fry choice. Liz, what can you do? Non. Non? Like non bread? Yeah. Is that a side dish? Liz, you are a hippie. Jacob. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go um, rice. Just straight up rice. Just straight up rice. Liz. Right down. Grits. G grits. Oh my yes. God. In the last second, she pulled out grits. Sausage. Sausage. Right. Breakfast side. I guess. Uh, I'm going to call it. Team uh, Marvel gets it with three points for a total of 21 <laughs> to 14. Let's clap for Team yeah. Marvel, everybody. Yeah. Well done. Yeah. And what better prize to win as a member of Team Marvel than this amazing Old Man Logan Yay. poster? Each Yay. get one of those posters. And um, whoever participated mm -hmm. most in this chat, which was Alyssa last week, it looks like she was the same this week, but I'm going to award it to my good friend. Uh, miss, uh, miss or Mr. I think it's Mr. Jendrick Hartz. Mm. You are going to win a copy of this Logan poster, Old Man Logan, coming out very soon for Mr. Uh, the Sunny Five on Instagram. Follow his amazing poster art. That has been our show for the DC and Marvel Facts and Trivia portion of uh, your night with uh, sidekicks as the theme. Thank you so much for watching. Dallas, where can people find you online you. or in person? Uh, you can check me out online, Facebook, uh, Dallas James, or uh, Twitter at Dallas James ACT. Fantastic. Liz, how about you? Hey, um, my Twitter handle is Liz Fenning, that's F as in Frank, E-N-N-I-N-G, um, or you could check out the really cool website for Actors for Autism if you want to get involved. It's Actors, F-O-R, Autism.com. Amazing. Alvin, how about you? Even though I lost my geek credibility, <laughs> <laughs> I really did, you can find me at Alvin Rueda on Twitter, and find this new show called The Mighty Blue Cheese. Check that out on YouTube. <laughs> Amazing. And Jacob? Um, I'm uh, Jacob Smith 550 on most things, and uh, it's a made-up number. Um, <laughs> and yeah, that's it. That's where you find me. Fantastic! If you guys like trivia and you want more trivia in your <coughs> weekly life, check out the Trivia with Buds podcast every Tuesday morning at 8 a.m. Pacific time on uh, wherever you can find podcasts: iTunes, Google Play, Stitcher, all that good stuff. It's fun. Friends of mine going head to head, just like this, but with uh, more variety of topics that venture away from DC and Marvel. But sometimes we do have DC and Marvel in there, so check that out and uh, watch the Stream TV every single day for amazing programs and after shows on your favorite superhero shows. And follow me on Twitter at Ryan Buds, B-U-D-D-S. Guys, thanks so much for being my guest. Nice. We'll see you Thank next you. time on the Stream TV with DC and Marvel. Facts Woo. and trivia with Buds. Thank you. <laughs> that was easy. Bye-bye. <Bye> yeah. <laughs>